Well, after that deadly shooting outside of Atrisco Heritage High School, community officials are calling again for action against gun violence. News 13's Jessica Barone spoke with a nonprofit who says we need to be doing more. It's not one conversation we need to have. It's hundreds of conversations that we need to have. The deadly shooting in the parking lot of Atrisco Heritage Academy High School Friday night has left the community heartbroken. The Bernalillo County Sheriff's Office says 16-year-old Elijah Paul Morphin and 16-year-old Adrian Martinez were playing with firearms in a car when one accidentally went off, killing Paul Morphin. Albuquerque Public Schools officials spoke against the violence, calling it senseless. If you're a parent, you have got to talk to your kids. You have got to help them understand the harsh reality of what happens when they get their hands on a gun. The nonprofit New Mexicans to Prevent Gun Violence says this kind of crime has gone on too long. We lost a 16-year-old to gun violence and a 16-year-old who was playing around with, it sounds like was playing around with a firearm. Um, it, it happens too often. Co-president Miranda Viscoli says the nonprofit has joined forces with the State Department of Health to tackle the issue. They've launched the website teaching gun owners how to keep their weapons away from their kids and even offering free gun locks. Youth having guns has been normalized. And so we have to help our young people understand that that normalization isn't okay, that it's only going to get them hurt or in jail. They also host 10 to 12 week workshops at schools to talk about prevention. Viscoli says it's about educating teens in order to protect them. That that school now and that community is suffering greatly and it could have all been prevented. Jessica Barron, Caracuy News 13. School officials said they will have an increased police presence on campus tomorrow, along with counseling services to support students.